Russia's new tactic for bombarding Kyiv. Twice over the span of three days on December the 11th and 13th, Russia attacked Kyiv with ballistic missiles launched from ground-based systems, most likely the S-400, according to NV media outlet. On those nights, Ukrainian air defense shot down eight and ten missiles, respectively. After the strikes on December the 11th, Air Force spokesman Yuri Inat urged patience as authorities determined whether the missiles used were Iskander-M ballistic missiles or S-400 anti-aircraft guided missiles. On December the 13th, Andrew Yermak, head of the Office of the President, stated that the enemy may have struck Kyiv with 48N6 missiles from the S-400 complex. According to him, the target was a critical infrastructure object. Experts from Defense Express military media outlet argue that if reports on the use of the S-400 are confirmed, this may indicate a dangerous trend in Russian missile terror. Namely, it means that they can proceed to carry out systematic ballistic strikes on Kyiv with the aim of immolating our citizens' morale. During its full-scale invasion of Ukraine, Russia has repeatedly used anti-aircraft missiles to strike targets on the ground, including with its S-300 and S-400 systems. The Russians seem to have modified their missiles for this purpose. Instead of a semi-active homing head, which is required to hit an airborne target, a satellite receiver is mounted instead, enabling control of the missile so that it flies to certain coordinates. At the same time, such strikes are very dangerous since the missile's accuracy is dramatically reduced in comparison to shots at aerial targets. In particular, the last time Kiev was bombarded with such missiles before December the 11th to the 13th was nearly a year ago. On January the 14th, 2023, the capital was shaken by loud explosions without a preceding air raid alert. At that time, an infrastructure facility in the city was hit and the general staff announced that the capital had been attacked by 10 missiles fired from an S-400 system from the north, most likely from Russia's Bryansk Oblast.